How's it going, Rogues Gallery, and welcome to another Sorcery Contested Realm video here on Red Zone Rogue. It has been a while since we have a dedicated video to Sorcery Contested Realm. The last video I talked about this game was in my top five most anticipated games of 2023, where Sorcery, of course, is on that list. And I figured now is the perfect time to do an update telling you what my plans are for Sorcery, because, you know, as you might have guessed, it's not going anywhere. I've just been kind of biding my time, and we'll talk about why. Um, so yeah, let's do that today. All about Source. If you like the channel, if you want to support, I do have various ways in the links down below. We have Patreon, where we give away like custom cards every single month, as well as channel memberships and my online store and all that kind of good stuff. But today... The catalyst for this is, one, we have Sorcery coming out pretty soon, two, I've been talking to Eric, the creator of Sorcery, somewhat recently about maybe doing some, some content in the near future, and three, I recently, finally, got my Sorcery paintings. These are original paintings from Sorcery, framed up. So here we have the Black Scorpions by uh, Michael Nagipal. I ap apologize if I mispronounce your name, but really, really cool. Um, so yeah, just got this back. This is going to be hung up in the background. Not here, but like over off screen. You'll see it in my live streams. You'll see it in my live streams. And then the other painting, which I have not shown off yet in a video. And this is a very, very spicy one. So in Sorcery, there are four mix cards. They're the mix element cards. They are all unique rarity. So they're the highest rarity. And they all have the same kind of effect. If you are a person who plays a lot of magic, they are kind of like... Black Lotuses or Moxin, where they have, they're more like a Black Lotus, where they have like a one-time effect of giving you three of whatever resource, right? Each mix corresponds to one of the four elements in sorcery, fire, water, air, and earth. And I happen to have the original painting for Mix Terra, the earth one. So this is a bit of a bigger, this is a bit of a bigger painting, so I'm gonna have to scoot back a little bit. So here is my framed original Mix Terra. Look how awesome this looks. Look how awesome this is. Oh, it's so cool. I am incredibly honored to have two original paintings from Sorcery. And I wanted to show them off in this video, not just as like a flex or just to kind of do an art showcase, which I very much love the art. By the way, the artist here is Elvira Shakarova, who is a fantastic, I mean, just look at the art. It speaks for itself. It's, it's absolutely beautiful. I love it so, so much. Um, and there's a reason why I have it. And once again, this will also go up in the studio kind of off the screen over here you'll see it and you'll see it in live streams uh we'll talk about live streams too because i do plan on live streaming some sorcery somewhat soon um but anyway my whole point here is that i want to talk about the art i want to showcase the art but i want to talk about how the game is more than just art and how the shift from like talking about the game and appreciating the art is going to shift from that to the actual gameplay and actually playing the game because that's where my shift and my focus is going to be. Obviously, love the art, love supporting the artists and getting one of a kind pieces like this. Um, in fact, it's been like a very long, you know, thought dream of mine to have original art from a card game that I love like Sorcery. So very, very happy to have this and the Black Scorpions. But the overall point that I'm trying to get across is that I'm very, very excited to play this game. And because of that, I have been avoiding as much spoilers as I can. I want to go into this as blind as possible. I want to see as little art as possible, as little mechanics as possible, and have that truly organic experience. Opening a, bo a booster box of sorcery for the first time um, and having that like you know, sense of wonder. And that's how I'm approaching sorcery. That's how much I'm looking forward to this. I've been thinking about this a lot and I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to bide my time until it's ready, until my 12 Kickstarter boxes come, and I'm going to open them. Maybe not all 12, but I'm going to open up a lot of them. Um, most of them on stream, we're going to have separate videos for it. We might even have an early box opening. We'll, we'll maybe show that off and talk about that a little bit later. But um, I, I have plans for sorcery. It's going to be hard to film gameplay, like actual physical gameplay, but I love the game, and I want to do like deck techs and just, just fun things around the game. And... That's my plans for Sorcery. We are going to be doing a live stream launch celebration. I'm going to be giving away some awesome stuff during that live stream launch. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll think about exactly what we're going to be giving away, but I'm, I'm considering an entire Kickstarter booster box. Because um, I don't need 12. I don't need 12. Um, and I figured some other folks out there would enjoy it. And um, yeah, 
that, that that's kind of where we're going here. I'm very, very excited to play the game. Obviously, I, I, I'm a huge, huge fan of the art in the game. Um, but at the end of the day, I buy these games to play because I love playing games. That's the whole point here. It's all about the card games. I love playing the games and I'm very much looking forward to this. This is a game that um, I plan to play with my partner, uh, whether she wants to build her own decks or I'll, you know, maybe I'll make, make a bunch of like decks that are good to play against each other. Um, but that's, that's my plans for sorcery. Very much looking forward to it. We will start ramping up the sorcery content in the next couple weeks. Well, next couple months as um, shipments are fulfilled and we start getting product. And even though I heavily playtested the game in like an early alpha state, I know that a ton of the cards have changed since then. I mean, at the very base level, the avatars now have attacks, like an attack value built in where they did not before. And so I have been kind of avoiding, once again, avoiding a lot of the updates in terms of like, in terms of mechanics and that kind of stuff, because I want to experience this as blind as possible. I have played, like I said, extensively those alpha like playtest decks that I, I still own. Um, but since then, you know, since since then, I've been kind of trying to avoid things as much as possible, and I and I could not be more excited for it. So, that's where we are with sorcery. Just a quick little update. I'm curious to the folks out there who also backed sorcery. What are your plans for the game? I know a lot of folks are like flipping their boxes already, but I really hope there are a good amount of people out there who just genuine genuinely want to play. Um, there are boxes available for the beta version of the game. They're a little expensive, but you know, I think they're like 150 bucks a box, something like that. But honestly, like, it, it's kind of just a more, I don't want to say more premium product, but, but kind of, kind of. And since they're only going to be releasing like one or two sets a year, I don't think it's that much of an ask. And also, I don't think it's the kind of game where you want to just buy a crap load of boxes. You maybe, buy, you maybe buy like a couple and then, you know, build up your starter decks or something like that. Because it's not a competitive game, right? It's more of like a board game type experience. I know they will have events, you know, at like, um, you know, Gen Con and that kind of stuff. We'll have events and tournaments. But it's not the kind of game where you go on a competitive pro tour circuit or anything like that. It's not Flesh and Blood or Magic the Gathering. It's more of a, a social exper experience. And I think... It's a really, really fun one. So, yeah, that's it. That's sorcery. Expect more in the future. I'm going to hang these paintings up very soon. You'll see them in the background of future streams and all that kind of good stuff. So thank you so much for watching, and um, we'll see you next time. See you later, everyone.